Hey everyone, so in this video, I'm going to show you how I use a straightener to get this super easy wavy hair look done. Stay tuned! Okay, so I'm starting off with freshly washed hair. A lot of hairstylists will say use day old or two day old hair to get the curl to hold better. However, it doesn't really make a difference for me, I find. Um, so I just use freshly washed hair. And plus, when I wait a day, my hair tends to get really oily very quickly. So the curl looks very oily. So I use freshly washed hair. Also, please don't mind the black spots on my straightener. I've literally had this straightener for 10 years. I bought it when I was 16 with my best friend in the mall. She was actually buying a straightener and I was with her. And the lady was like, oh, do you want to get the second one half off? And I think it was only like $50. So I was like, sure, because I didn't have one at the time. Um, I never actually used to straighten my hair back then. Um, and it, it honestly was the best purchase I've ever made. It, I mean, it lasted me 10 years. So, I mean, it needs a little cleaning up, but it does the job. And I think the brand of the straightener is called Amika. Um, when I was 16, the brand wasn't that big. I bought it from a kiosk in the mall, like I said. Um, but now I think that they, they've grown a little bit. They have hairsprays, they have mousse, I think. Um, and I definitely know that their hair straighteners are really popular as you can see i've been um, sectioning my hair and curling my hair away from my face to be honest this is just a preference i don't like when i curl the hair um, towards my face it's not a very flattering look for me however if you like that look go for it this is just my preference Okay, also, as you can see, after I'm finished curling a piece of my hair, I'll kind of twirl it with my finger, and then as I'm hairspraying it, I'll push it up with my palm. I find that this really helps the curl keep its shape, and the curl lasts uh, longer when I do this. So the brand of hairspray that I'm using here is called Got To Be. And to be honest, I've had better. The curl didn't hold as well as I wanted it to, so I probably wouldn't recommend it. And it didn't have a nice smell to it either, so it's gonna be a no from me. So for this look, each section I'm curling in the same direction. Um, if you're looking to get more of a beachy, wavy vibe, then you can alternate between each section and direction to get that look. But for this one, I wanted to have it all in the same direction to kind of get that Hollywood uh, wave vibe. So as you can see here, I was struggling to find the right flattering angle to curl my hair. Um, this is my first time that I was filming doing my hair in front of a camera, so the struggle was real. Um, but at the end of it, I was didn't bother with a flattering angle. I just curled my hair. I couldn't be bothered. <laughs> I also got hairspray in my mouth a few times, but I mean, it was worth it. As they say, beauty is pain, which is kind of a weird saying if you think about it. <laughs> I don't think it should mean inhaling hairspray or burning yourself by accident, which is what happened to me when I first started using the straightener. And I had this huge burn mark on my neck and my parents thought it was a hickey. And I <laughs> had no idea how to convince them that it was from my straightener, which, you know, back in the day they never had. So that was an interesting time in my life. <laughs> Anyways, I'm actually curious, um, do you guys like using a wand or a curling iron better or do you prefer using a straightener? For me, when I use um, curling wands or uh, curling irons, I don't get the same curl and I don't get the same wave effect um, that I would get when I use a straightener. But I have seen hairdressers um, get that effect with using wands and the curling iron. So I'm wondering if it's just me. If you guys have any techniques out there, please leave a comment below. I'm really curious to know how um, to achieve that look with either a wand or an, uh, a curling iron. So I'm just finishing up curling the last pieces of my hair. I'm going to hairspray all over to make sure all the curls um, set in very well. And then I'm gonna wait 10 minutes, gonna go finish getting ready, and I will show you guys what I do when I come back. All right, so now that I'm back, I'm just gonna take my big round brush and brush out all those curls in my hair. I know it's gonna seem like you did all that work for nothing, 
but trust me uh, to get that wavy Hollywood look you're gonna need to do this step and kind of just play around with it run your fingers through it to get the look that you want um, it takes me about five minutes to um, set my hair properly I really hope you guys like this video if you want to see more like it please subscribe like and leave a comment see you guys in the next video bye for now